Hi there, welcome to the next video. And in this video, I will show you a different condition where we will use the if statement prior to the for loop. And the idea is that, that if my attendance is above average, that means greater than or equals to 35, then add two to it. Otherwise, you know, remove the two from that. Okay, so let's do that. First of all, let me again execute this and what i'll do is i will say new attendance then tenants and uh, what we'll use is our operator which is i and then plus two if i is greater than equals to 35 else i minus two so as you can see this is a very very simple condition just to get an understanding to start with the this kind of a list comprehension so what we are saying that increase the i with 2 if i is greater than 35 that means over here in this list else i minus 2 so now we need to go inside the list so for that for i in attendance well that's all you need and if I say new attendance, new underscore attendance, and here I have my new attendance where in case of 35, it has been increased by 2, so 37, 37 is increased by 2, 39, similarly, 32 decreased by 2, so 30, 28, and then 32. So this is just to give you the starting about how you can use the if else on each of the element not just to restrict the list like we had done it earlier and after the for loop but even you can use the if condition prior to the for loop apply some sort of a calculation on each of the element and get the new list based on your business rules or business needs so that's about it how you can use the if else prior to the for statement and then get the desired output.